Up ahead is the island of Niue, spelled N-I-U-E. It's about 300 miles almost due south of American Samoa. And uh, this is Thursday, a bit afternoon. Uh, three days since I left American Samoa. As you can see, I'm sailing along quite light, nicely. This is only the second time I've had the opportunity to use the asymmetrical spinnaker and uh, got the stay sail pulled out to starboard to balance the boat. The last two days from American Samoa, I ran the engine almost constantly. There's very, very little wind, and now, surprisingly enough, in the heart of the southeast trade winds, the wind is coming from about the north-northwest. I'm about 11 miles from the harbor where they have moorings for uh, visiting sailboats. There's no way to anchor. So I'm looking forward to that because then I won't have to fight with anchoring in a deep anchorage. The trip has been pretty uneventful but quite slow because of uh, being under power so much. Right now it's a real light breeze, maybe 8 or 10 knots, maybe a little bit more, up to 12 knots occasionally. And the boat's making about 4.5 knots. It's Sunday morning, October the 8th. And this shot is out to the west, looking across the expanse of the ocean. So I slowly swing to the north. You can see the edge of the island, that's Niue. And as I pan around, this is Alofi Bay on the west side of Niue. That's the dinghy landing area. It's uh, quite a chore. You got to go over there and scrabble up the side of the dock and hook your dinghy onto the derrick and hoist it up out of the water and store it on land so it doesn't get beat to pieces with the surge coming in here to the bay. Fortunately, Nui put in these uh, very nice, very well done uh, moorings so the boats have a place to tie up because the water out here in the bay is quite deep. I'm in about 120 feet of water right now. And uh, of course they ch have a daily charge for using the moorings. As you can see the boat's uh, rolling back and forth. It's very difficult to get the boat situated in any manner that it doesn't get rolled by the swell. Because of course a big southwest swell is always coming in here and it rebounds off all the sides of the bay so there's swells always in here from three or four different directions so sooner or later the boat's going to roll from it. As you can see there's It's Saturday morning, October the 14th, uh, a little bit past 9 o'clock. That island back there is Niue. I just left this morning. Before I left, I had a wonderful treat. A uh, mother humpback whale and her calf were in the bay swimming around within about 100 yards of me. So that was quite a treat. All the other yachties missed out because they were still asleep. It's a beautiful day, 
Wind's blowing probably up around 18 knots. It's a little cloudy, but I think as the day progresses, uh, there's quite a few clear spots. Uh, a lot of this cloudiness, I hope, will go away. It's a beautiful day for sailing. And as normal, I'm uh, really packed the sail on, get the boat moving. Right now, I'm sailing with the uh, Genoa and the stay sail pulled out to port and a double reefed mainsail. Helm's pretty well balanced and the boat's moving along quite nicely. Probably up around six knots. These are running, uh, oh, I don't know, up in the six foot range. And as you can see, Phoenix is just smoking along here. Sailing from Nui to Vavao, Tonga. Beautiful Saturday afternoon.